Hello, my lovely students. How are you? Uh, today is uh, the 3rd of May 2021. Uh, I have read the lesson to you in the previous uh, uh, lesson. I will read the lesson again. Just listen carefully to me. What time did you arrive? Kareem. Hello, Mom. Samira. We liked school today. Mom. Hello, children. Good. Come into the living room. We have visitors. Kareem. Uncle Isa and Aunt Majida. What time did you arrive? Uncle Isa. We arrived at 11 o'clock this morning. Samira, how did you travel here from Petra? Aunt Majida, we traveled by car. Karim, we learned about Petra at school today. Aunt Kalisa, what did you learn about? Karim, Miss Nadia showed us photos of Petra. It's at the bottom of a canyon. It's uh, it's at the bottom of the it's at the bottom of a canyon the seek Samira where did people live Aunt Majida they lived in caves in the rocks they carved tunnels in the rocks Petra is very beautiful Okay, my students, and we discuss the lesson objectives. تناقشنا في أهداف الدرس. How can we form a sentence in affirmative? In affirmative. كيف نشكل جملة بالمثبت? In the past tense, we add ed for the verb. Don't forget that. And in negative form, negative, we add didn't before the verb, and the verb will be verb one infinitive. And we discuss the uh, W H questions. Let's start with W H. What time or what day? How, what, where, when, who, why, which. شرحت لكم ياها إنه لما نبدأ السؤال ب W H questions طبعا بينتهي ب question mark علامة سؤال. وتناقشت معكم كيف الصيغة. The question form. Sir, the question. Where did you go? Be the question. Be where? Or when? Or who? Or what? نضع did في زمن الماضي لأن الجملة في زمن الماضي وما ننسى بعد did بيكون في فاعل سواء كان جمع أو مفرد بعدها بيجي الفعل مجرد لما نجاوب الفعل بيتحول. للماضي سواء كان منتظم أو غير منتظم المنتظم regular اللي منضيف له ed أما الغير منتظم irregular verbs we change it like this منغيرهم على حسب الفعل أعطيتكم قائمة أنا عشان تحفظوهم تصريف الأفعال when did you visit your friend نفس الشي بعد when وضعنا ال did وراها بيجي الفاعل بعدين الفعل المجرد طبعا بالإجابة الفعل المجرد بيتحول لماضي I visited ونكمل الجملة هاي مراجعة اللي عطتكم إياها بالحصة الماضية وتناقشنا في كلمات الدرس وكيف إنه لفظها الصحيح
And now today we're going to talk about the interrogative form. Interrogative form. صيغة السؤال اللي هو B W H question. We use where when we ask about a place. نستخدم where يعني أين للسؤال عن المكان. For example. For example, where did you stay last night? أين أقمت البارحة؟ هلا ملاحظين إنه بالسؤال بعد وير وضعنا did uh, الفعل بيجي مجرد بالسؤال طبعا السؤال ب where لازم الإجابة يكون فيها مكان معين I stayed in a hotel last night الإجابة للسؤال بوير المكان اللي راحوا أقاموا فيه in a hotel we use when when للسؤال عن الزمن الوقت متى when we ask about time لما نسأل عن الزمن زمن معين For example, when did you arrive? متى وصلت؟ لاحظين when متى؟ الإجابة للسؤال ب when بيكون في وقت معين. طبعا الفعل مجرد. هلا الفعل مجرد بده يتحول لماضي في الجواب. ال طبعا هاي يعني انتوا بتعرفوها انه ال you بتتحول ل I أو we على حسب المخاطب. I arrived at six o'clock yesterday evening. So the answer is this. Hi, Ijabet. Soal B when at six o'clock. Miss Al B when. كل لازم إجابتها يكون في وقت معين أو من تقطيعات اليوم اللي هو morning or afternoon, evening like this. We use what. To ask about things, نستخدم what, ماذا أو ما للسؤال عن أشياء أو ممكن للسؤال عن الأسماء. What did you learn about at school? ماذا تعلمت في المدرسة? This is the verb, the infinitive verb here. The verb راح يتغير لصيغة الماضي. We add ed. You will become we or I, as I told you. مثل ما خبرتكم اليوم ممكن تتحول ل I أو we. We learned about Petra. هلا سؤال ب what سؤال عن شيء معين ما ذكروا لكن بالجواب بنذكره. إحنا عن شو تعلمنا عن إيش عن Petra. Okay. Now my students. Do you think Petra is a beautiful city in Jordan? This question is for you. هذا السؤال لكم. You want to answer it. Do you think Petra is a beautiful city in Jordan? هل تعتقدون أن بترا هي أجمل مدينة في الأردن؟ لاحظين هنا شو حطينا؟ Question mark. دائما في صيغة السؤال. سواء ب do أو does أو what أو where أو when W H question يكون ال ال نهايته question mark. What can you see in Petra? ماذا تستطيعون أن تروا في Petra? What do you think? We can see tunnels. We can see caves. We can see rocks. Is that right? This is Petra. Look, we can see tunnels, cave. We can see canyon, الوادي الضيق. We can see rocks. Is that right? Now, my students, I want from you to answer these questions. 
according to our lesson. Number one, is Samira happy and why? Why is she happy? Limada. Limada here. I think that yes, she is. Yes, she is. Why? Why? Because she liked school. Number two, who are the visitors? Men, hum, al zuwar. Who are the visitors? Of course, their visitors are Uncle Isa and Aunt Maryam. Number three, when did they arrive? When we ask with when, we want the time, the exactly time. The exact time. Yes, they arrived at 11 o'clock this morning. Number four, how did they travel? How? We asked about how did they travel? Kaif, Kaifa, Safaro. Yes, they traveled by car. Number five, what did Karim and Samira learn about at school? ماذا تعلموا في المدرسة? What do you think? Yes, they learned about Petra at school today. Number six, what did their teacher show them? ماذا أردتهم المعلمة؟ ماذا عرضت عليهم؟ Yes, what do you think? She showed them photos of Petra. This is the correct answer. She showed them uh, photos of Petra. Number seven. Where did people in Petra live in the past? Ma aina aina sakano nas fi Petra fil madi. Where? I think this is the answer. They lived in caves in the rocks. And the last question, what did they carve? Carve. Mada nahatu? In nasili fil madi. Mada nahatu? They carved tunnels in the rocks. I want to write them. In your copy notebox, please, and answer uh, the question all. Now, my students, open your people's book, page number 61. Look at exercise 2. Listen and choose. Stamar wa ikhtar. We can see many photos here. Look at the first one here. What can you see? Yes, it's a plane. It's a flying in the sky. And here, yes, it's a train. I can see a train here. And the picture here, we can see a car in the street. Look at this. What's this? It's a tent. Do you remember the tent? Tent. Khayma. Here we can see a hotel. Yes, it's a building. A big building. Here it's a big house. You can see a house. Okay, I will read questions for you and you will choose from number one A or B or C. Listen carefully. How did you travel to Petra last summer? We traveled by car. So which photo I'm talking about? Yes, 
yeah they traveled by car so this is the correct one number one with c look at number two Where did you stay in Petra? We stayed in a hotel. Aina akamtum fi Petra, nahnu akamna fi hotel or funduk. So where is the correct photo here? Yes, this is the correct one. So number two with B. Now my students, open your activity book, page number 57. Look at exercise one, look and write under Uktub. Look at these uh, different photos. We have three uh, highlighted parts. And uh, يعني تلت أجزاء مضللة ومختلفة مواقعها. Okay, we have a tunnel, a canyon, and a rock. The first one is already done. A tunnel. Look, a tunnel. نفق أو أو قناة. A tunnel. Look at this. The highlight part here is what? The highlight part here is what? A canyon or a rock? Yes, it's a rock. So right here, a rock. Look at the third photo. The highlight part here is what? A canyon. Canyon. Write it here. A canyon. And that's it for today, my lovely students. Thanks for listening to me. And have a nice time. Goodbye.